RSJ read Lucas for filth in that meeting because he used his money to fund the Ponzi scheme. Now, Lucas is going to want some kind of revenge towards Braden because he leaked that information, which led to a trickle effect to RSJ finding out about it. Now, don't be surprised if RSJ goes around the world and tells everyone about what Weston Holdings does, jeopardizing the whole business and shutting down everything. Now, Braden right here, he knows that he messed up, but he doesn't really care, but your boy Lucas has some vindictive plans for Brayden, and that is going to lead to Brayden finally catching the body, which means that this first body is going to be his own uncle, because we've been waiting for Brayden to catch a body for some time since the beginning because of the Because time season. and time again, Brayden has showed us how much of a chump he is, and if he can take out his own uncle, Lucas, then maybe... That'll prove that Brayden is cut out for this life after all. Now, when he catches this body, Brayden is going to go through a slight change. I don't expect this character to change so drastically because it's only one body but however this is a family member you know what i'm talking about this is a family member we're talking about and power has a wild weird ass obsession with family members killing family members in this series when kanan killed his own son when tommy killed his own father when tyreek killed his own father i mean it's just a repeated cycle of family death and so when brayden finally kills his uncle lucas it's definitely going to affect him but it is going to numb him once he gets deeper in the game and him and tyreek are going to be equally the same now this whole comparison between ghost and tommy and 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 and, 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 and tyreek and brayden i don't see it they at all the first tyreek and brayden though they have their own story but for them to be a whole emulation of tommy and ghost get out of here there will never be anything like that they don't compare and i'm not accepting that but brayden is going to step up to the plate because we're getting towards the end game. Well, the season finale, we still haven't seen Noma yet. And if you pay attention to the trailer, you see where Kane is talking about Noma's coming after all of us. So there is going to be a war brewing in the next two episodes. So y'all let me know what y'all think. Do you think that Uncle Lucas will come after Brayden? And if so, will Brayden take him out? Y'all let me know in the comments. Hit that like and hit that subscribe because I can tell you right now, this slide, what it's depicting, it looks like Brayden is hemming up Lucas. And from the looks of it, it doesn't look like the result is going to be good. It don't look like it's going to be a scuffle and someone breaks it up. It don't look like someone's going to win the fight. I do know that someone is going to walk away alive, though, and someone's going to be laid out. But y'all got to let me know what y'all think in the comments. Will Brayden check out his uncle as his first body? And if so, how do you think will it affect him? Because I can tell you right now in this image coming up, we see Brayden and Tyreek putting in some work. And it seems like it's going to be in the last episode. And season finale is crazy in the power seasons. So, yeah, we're waiting for this moment. And it's going to be lit. But anyway, I'm off this. Y'all take care of yourselves. I'm gone.